So you can speak to this uh, as someone who has been working in this industry for such a long time. Also, you tagged with Ricky Reyes last show at Catalyst. Yeah, we, we, we teamed together, uh, me, and, me and Ricky Reyes, uh, victorious as we were. Listen, Ricky's just straightforward professional, right? He's, he's a professional wrestler, no flash, uh, you know. He's just going to come straight ahead, and he's going to grind you, and he's going to make you earn every little bit you're going to get in that ring. For sure. There is an obvious size difference here, I would say. We have uh, Maddox, who's built kind of like a defensive lineman, I would say. Uh, and then we have Reyes, who's a bit smaller and agile on his feet. I'm excited to see you know, Maddox, because you know, he, he's got a good, uh, you know, good size to him. But from what I hear, he's pretty agile for, for a man of that size. So let's see if he can use that to his advantage here. And, that, and if, I'm, if I'm Ricky Reyes, that's exactly what I'm going to try to do. Keep the bigger man on the mat. Take one of his legs out. Put him down to size. It's a sound strategy. For you sure. A lot of that veteranship right there with Ricky Reyes, utilizing the elbow into the knee joint, trying to cause some tension. They call him the hybrid athlete, but you're not much of an athlete laying on your back. Ricky Reyes knows exactly what he needs to do and how he needs to chop the big man down here. Wasn't I, that long ago where you were teaming with Mr. Reyes? Yeah, well, I first met Ricky Reyes back in 2004. We both competed in the Super 8 tournament. And that was the first time I got to know him and, uh, you know, followed his career ever since. And like I said, he's just a pro's pro. Um, he knows his way around that ring. Uh, he's been in every situation possible. And, uh, you know, much like Gio Galvano last night, I think Mr. Maddox is in for a little bit of a lesson here, courtesy of Ricky Reyes. A word that often used with Ricky Ray is wily. This guy is very cunning. He can find a victory out from situations most people don't even look to find. And now we have a standoff here between Tyson and Ricky Reyes. Earlier tonight when I spoke to Maddox, he actually told me that he feels like he's gotten across that for a big man he's quite agile in the ring. But tonight he really wants to prove uh, his wrestling prowess in the ring. Well, you know, that's all well and fine, but you know, sometimes you want to stick to where, where your where your bread's buttered, so to speak, right? If you try to get off on your game plan by trying to prove something to somebody, it may backfire. So, but you see, obviously, Ricky Reyes has scouted his agility, keeps going after that leg, targeting that leg because you can't be very agile if you're if you're hobbling around on one leg in that ring. Yep, one legged man doesn't have much of a vertical leap for sure. And there's a nice roll through there by Ricky Reyes. He had, did not let go. He has got that key lock on. High and tight, and now Tyson finds himself on the other side. Tyson just completed a tour in Mexico not too long ago. I don't know if he's been in the ring since that tour, but if he's got any rust on him now, Ricky Reyes is going to find that, and he's going to use it to his advantage. When I spoke to Tyson earlier today, he actually said he took one of Ricky Reyes' seminars two years ago. Mm. So it's kind of coming full circle for him right now. Absolutely. You, know, you wonder if he's a little intimidated, you know, kind of uh, being in that situation now. and trying to prove himself against the veteran. Absolutely. Can the student overcome the teacher? We'll find out here in this contest, Global Fest night, Global Festival Night 2. Maddox is also yet to pull out a win here at Global Syndicate Wrestling. So to pull out a win against Ricky Reyes tonight could make a really big, uh, big impression yeah, well, on those in the back. Everything's about momentum in this industry, right? And so, you know, if, if Maddox can get a victory here tonight, he can start building that momentum. And that's what you need to have, especially if you want to start catching the eyes of the people that make decisions, put the championship title matches together. Showcasing. Could that be a little bit of showboating there? A little bit, but I don't think you're going to get in Ricky Reyes' head. He's, he's a veteran. He's been around this game too long. So Ricky Reyes now and Tyson Maddock back where we began, back at square one here between the two competitors. Both of these individuals would love an opportunity to call themselves a champion here. Another win from either of these two men would put themselves in great position to do just that. Oh, look at that. Nice reversal. There's some of that wrestling showcase Sam you were mentioning earlier. Trying to show it to the veteran that he can do it. Not just a, not just a, 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 a high value athlete. Doesn't just jump high, doesn't just run fast, doesn't just lift heavy. He can get it done on the mat. that long ago where you were teaming with Ricky Reyes at Catalyst, as a matter of fact, against Gio Galvano and Super Nitro. Sam, you mentioned earlier, he's trying to show off his wrestling skills right there, and you see it. Some nice counters and reversals. Yeah, but sometimes yes. when you show off with a guy with oh, there it is. over 50 oh, years of experience, he gets you. But it, it would seem that Maddox has, uh, has the advantage right now. He's staying on Ricky Reyes, showing what he's made of. Very Ricky impressive Re so far. Reyes has his foot on the rope, okay. 
reset. But I tell you what, you start worrying about showing off for these fans. Start worrying about goofing off in there. Next thing you know, you're gonna get punched right in the mouth. Oh, that. Yeah, you gotta stay focused. That can't be Mika Reyes in the bright mood. He's gotta be getting seething right now. No. If I'm, you know, if I'm Tyson Maddox and I'm winless, I'm not showboating. I'm not playing around with a guy like Ricky Reyes. I'm trying to put him away as quickly and as efficiently as possible because you make one mistake and a veteran like Ricky Reyes will capitalize on it. Absolutely, the veteran, Ricky Reyes, he's gotta be getting hot. Side headlock applied there by Ricky Reyes, center in the ring. I'm just waiting to see who's gonna be the first man to score that big move right now because no one's really getting the advantage. Reyes Absolutely. unable oh, and there's some of that power. to knock down There's some of that strength from the big man. Now we're picking the tempo up a little bit. Don't get it twisted, Ricky can go too. Whoa. Tilt a war into a slam by Tyson Maddox. Hooks the leg, that'll press only a two. Only a two, this crowd really getting into Tyson Maddox right now. Now from Tyson Maddox, stay on Ricky Reyes. Don't give him a chance to breathe. Don't give him a chance to recoup. Keep that offense going. It's good to get the adulation of the audience. It could be a mistake to revel in it during the course of a match. Oh, great for his alley -oop. Oh! There goes the alley -oop Goes for the Tyson. pin. Could this be it? I'll tell you what, he didn't have his weight really positioned over Ricky Reyes there. A little bit of a lackadaisical cover. Not just a lackadaisical cover. You see, Ricky Reyes didn't just lift his shoulder, he shoved him off. Yeah. Ricky's starting to get a little hot here. I think every time that you pin your opponent, you want to put all your weight on you want to, you want to make him expend energy to actually kick out. Absolutely. It all calls, it all counts toward the end of the matchup. I thought Ricky Reyes was going to put a thumb in the eye right there. That's what I would have done. Maybe Ricky Reyes is trying to beat the young man in his own game. Oh, suplex. Oh, we got Dos. Dos Amigos. He's got him up. What a show of strength from Tyson Maddox. Stalling vertical suplex. Oh, he's got the squats in there. Impressive. It's going to be a long way down. Oh, that's, this is the hybrid athlete. It is in the zone. There's a cover. Two. Referee Vinny in great position there. And only a two. a little count. bit like a brain buster. Wasn't quite a vertical suplex. Wasn't a, 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 a typical brain buster, but somewhere in between. Did a lot of damage right now. Tyson's firmly in control. And well, he has to stay on Reyes. He can't take advantage of uh, the space in between them. Or rather, nope. he can't take advantage if there is space in between them. That gives Reyes an opportunity to come back up. Ooh, what a back elbow there by Tyson. Nanny. Looks like he was reaching out to you there. Yeah, we're not tagging this this oh. time, Ricky. <laughs> you going to get in there? He might. Not he, tonight. All right. <laughs> he might have. He might have gotten a little confused in the moment. I was in a war last night. You know, tonight I'm just going to kind of recoup and and figure out what my next challenge is going to be here in, in GSW. Yes, you had quite the match with Gio Galvano for the next-gen title last night. It was, I was very impressed. i got to give Gio's credit. Yes, well, we'll see him in action later tonight against Yoya for that title. Absolutely. There we go. Hooks the leg or Tyson Maddox. That matchup for the gen, next-gen championship here tonight. Gio Galvano defending against the shooter weight. So here's where I think maybe the inexperience might come into play. Tyson's hit a few moves. He's feeling good about himself. But you, now he's starting to wonder, what do I have to do to put Ricky away? Mm -hmm. Right? I've, I've, I've used my power. I've used my strength. He's going to go back to the same thing. See if it works the second time. Oh, well, nope. second time's Keep not knocking. the charm right now. Oh, Ricky might have figured him out. Tents and O'Connor roll. Scoops him around. Oh, oh into a neck breaker. Did you see the torque on that? It dropped him right on his ear hole. And you see Ricky Reyes waste no time. He, he got that small opening, now he's going to take advantage. Now, we're not going to be able to sit here and tell Ricky to stay on. He knows he's going right for it. He's got a bullseye in the back of that neck. That torque, that spin on the neck breaker. He's going to go for it again. Go into the well yeah. then. This time got all of that. That's it. Focus on the body part. He did the damage with it the first time. Go right back to it. Keep knocking on that door until someone answers. And Ricky Reyes and Tyson Maddox right now, they're having a bit of a war themselves, back and forth. Here we go. This is Ricky Reyes right here. This is this is his style. He's going to beat you up. He's going to grind on you. He's going to beat you up. Not give you an inch to breathe. Look, he's just staying, just staying right on top of him. 
here in Asbury Park. We've been dealing with hurricane-like conditions. Ricky Ray has weathered his own storm now, and now he is in the driver's seat. Some fans that appreciate it. I am. Sam, we've seen Tyson perform at a high level time and time and time again. Is this his night? Can he fight back from this adversity? Well, he's certainly fighting back right now, so uh, the odds are in his favor at this very moment. Let's see what happens here. Tyson, oh, they had a bit of a collision there. Ah. Well, by this point in the match, you know, both men have been through a lot. Uh, maybe they were a little bit disoriented. Oh, what a punch. I think you're like, all right. I think Tyson Max is kind of fighting on instinct right now, right? Just, just kind of swinging anything that's moving in front of him, trying to get, buy himself some time, find his second wind. Hit the man, hit the one in the middle. You see Ricky Reyes, right? He's got he's keeping the hands over the nose and the mouth, making it hard to breathe for Tyson Maddox. Just these little things that the veterans bring to the table. Added pressure to the neck. After two neck breakers, now he's got that hold on. Oh, tremendous drop kick by Tyson Maddox to the face a, of Ricky Reyes. What a burst of energy there by Tyson Maddox. Yes, recovering, catching his breath after that uh, that hold, like you said, that was uh, blocking his airflow. Let's see if he can capitalize now. Ricky Ray is coming up off the defeat. So is Tyson Maddox. Ricky Both Ray is same time. looking Ray for another for W here in GSW. Tyson looking to get on the board. That neck breaker again. Third time's a charm. Tyson's feeling it. There's a cover again. Lateral press. Look at the distribution of weight by Ricky Reyes. Got to wonder if that lateral press puts pressure on the neck because you got to force him to kick out of that too. Well, you just anyway, you, you know, bend the guy's head sideways, put your put your, your palm on his chin, press down. There goes the whip there by Tyson. Counter by Ricky Reyes and a kitchen sink knee to the gut. That stops all momentum for Tyson Mannix and Ricky Reyes is trying to regain himself. So both guys breathing hard right now. You know, again, Tyson Max is a big dude. It means it takes more oxygen to keep that body fuel. The longer this match goes, you wonder if he's going to have those reserves to uh, catch that second wind and, and do any damage. So right now, Ricky's just keeping him down, grinding him on the mat, restricting that airflow, making it hard to breathe. He is wearing Tyson down. It's one thing to call yourself a hybrid athlete because you can do fantastic things. It's another to have the cardio of a great athlete. Tyson's being tested here tonight. Tyson has hit Ricky with the kitchen sink, and Ricky is still going, and now Tyson battling out. Almost looked like it might have been a little low, but... Oh, what a oh, high body cross by body. Tyson. It's a lot of weight to have come crashing down on you, on your ribs. But Tyson feeling the effects of all the work that Ricky Reyes has put on him. Not able to capitalize in the moment. Let's soon get to their feet first. Most matches like this, you wonder who's gonna make the first mistake. Now where the clock has been ticking, it's down to who can get up first at this point. Ricky Reyes, Tyson Maddox trying to gather themselves now. Trying Maddox to figure out the, the kill blow. The ropes. Yeah, and he's breathing heavy too. There's Ricky now, strike. Tyson firing up. Oh, throws that leg lariat back to his feet. And a clothesline by Tyson. And he's a rocket. He's a rolling. He's on his third, possibly his fourth win. What is this? Oh, powered him up. Reverse body slam. Running clothesline there. He's got all the way. Lateral press across. Didn't hook a leg. And that wasn't enough. What is he going to do next? By this time, he's probably expended lots of uh, what is in his arsenal. Whereas Ricky Reyes has an arsenal. Yeah, you know, when you're when you're new to the business, your toolbox isn't as deep as it is as, as you get more experience. So you start running out of things to do. You start hitting this guy with everything you know, and, and, and now you got to go back to the drawing board. He's going back to the alley oop again. Oh, oh, one time too many. Literally, your point two seconds ago. Oh, yeah, no one home. Ricky Reyes coming off the ropes. Oh, oh straight shot. And now Ricky Reyes is going to try to. Oh, there it is. Cradle of in. Crucifix. Oh, just he got just barely enough. got his shoulder on. 
What are these two guys going to do to have to do to put each other down? He called Ricky Ray as a wily veteran earlier. He's going to have to figure something out. He's on plan C, possibly D right now with Tyson Maddox. Oh, dropped his head a little too soon. There's that possible mistake. Oh, oh, oh the wow, that doesn't do it. My I don't know goodness. what it's going to. Oh, wow. <laughs> he picked him as high in the air as a deadlift can possibly be. I hope Ricky dropped. Reyes has a chiropractor on speed dial. He's going to need it after that. Oh, he's going to break the bank right don't here. Tell us. Show us. He's got him up. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, Reyes sliding out. Oh, back to that arm. He's back to that arm again. Oh, Maestro Cradle. Maestra. He's got the cradle, more of that Lucha influence. That it's, almost like, it's almost like Ricky Reyes knows he can't put him away with an offensive maneuver, and he's trying to catch him with one of these pinfalls. That's two in a row now where he's trying to tie him up and get that pinfall. His Ricky. offense just isn't having the effect that he wants. Oh, sunset, sunset flip, flip off second rope assisted. Ray is going for a pin of his own, oh, but Tyson rolling him up. Look at oh. that. Oh, surprise pin by Tyson Maddox. Surprise. 